Hi lovely viewers, it's me again your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. I'm even opening phone lines so that, uh, you know, people can 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 have their contribution you can bring in anything me that is the, this is my topic for tonight but you can bring in any issue that we can we can discuss we need when we say power belongs to the people your power is in your vote the power your power is in the vote power is is in the people power is in you but that power that power you need to be registered as a voter. If you are not registered as a voter, you don't have the power, my dear. So, empower yourself. Are you registered as a voter? Are you registered as a voter? I like that question. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, you see what? Thank you so very much. We should start reminding each other that we should register. Mm -hmm. um, some regions last time, the, Zambezi, the one you call Zambezi region, mm. tried foul that they didn't register. They were not given voters uh, analysis. Mm. As a result, they didn't vote. Mm. So I agree with you. Mm. This is a noble cause. We should do, call upon everyone to register. Number two, mm. I want to support your idea. Mm that Ilungo should stand, should run for president the third time. Mm -hmm. Let him run. Mm -hmm. Actually, me, I, these issues of limitation of someone not to run, people are enlightened, they are nothing. People can run as many times as they want. Zambians, they know what to do at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. The same way we want Lungo to, to run the third time, mm -hmm. we should also be prepared to, to allow HH to run the third time. Yeah without segregating anyone. The last thing I want to talk about, um, first of all, I want to to thank you for today's uh, speech. Mm -hmm. Today you are very objective. We are looking at the issues. I want to complain mm -hmm. that last the last session we had, um, we felt, I felt stigmatized. You are calling us Zambezi region. Daddy, let me tell you, it is very painful. And I'm so excited that the Zambezi region has not labeled the Northerners any funny name to, to make them look who, like they are not human beings. Yes, we are Zambezi regions. This thing of calling us Zambezi region, but now, we just realized that. You and I were taken here. Yeah. We say yes. when we call you Zambezi region, mm -hmm. we say you are not human beings. Yeah? Uh -huh. We say okay. Zambezi we region, does it mean that you are not human beings? But we are we are Zambezi region. Mm. Continue telling us we are Zambezi region. Mm. Let me tell you how we feel. Mm. We feel that okay, you guys who are superior, who don't have funny name. That is in your we, head. Why can't we just share this country? You you have your own part. We also have our own Zambezi region, where you continue misbehaving. That that's side. why we continue behaving. That's why the other we say. That's why we say any you are dividing the country. That's why you say you hear what you are saying. You are Let us have this side, because you are calling and you us also names. you also we are not calling you names. We are calling you what you are. You are calling us Zambezi. I'm a northerner. The I'm a northerner. If you call me a northerner, if you call me a northerner, I don't have an issue. Why do? You, why is it an issue for you when we call you Zambezi region? Why is it an issue? Okay. It is just your that's problem. Why, that's why I'm suggesting that probably this country Eight should division, be just divided. You, that you stay on your own, and we stay on our Zambezi region. That we are not going to be Mube in Pelefe. each other. Mube Pelefe, Zambia is a one is a unitary state. Mube Pelefe, we will not divide Zambia because of your selfishness. We will not. And if anything, you are just a few of you. You are just a few of you. We talk about, we cannot run away from talking about tribalism. We can't run away from it. Look at those, look at the, uh, what is happening in our government. Look at the constitutional court. Haka eh? Inde Ichirema is busy segregating against certain people from certain, certain regions. This is the fact. This is the fact. Look around, see how Haka Inde Ichirema is running. Look at the corporate uh, world. 
in the most of the directors the senior positions have gone to one region even in government sensitive and the bigger positions have gone to one region shouldn't we talk about it and when we talk about it that we are making you not to feel human no it is just you yourselves some of you who are benefiting out of the regionalism that Haka in the is practicing and you want to come up to say no we are making you feel like you are not human beings no no why is it i mean i'm bemba if you call me a, a bemba i don't jump around i don't jump around but you if i say you are tonga eh? Eh? Oh, why is it that a certain region has become sacred you touch it next day in a hate speech there is no hate speech against members. There is only hate speech against one region. Our court is full of cases, you know, of people speaking against, the, you know, Tongas. A hate speech, hate speech, hate speech. Isn't it hate speech when you call members to say, eh, 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 Do we complain? Mashori, 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 mashori. We don't have issues. We don't have cases that are in court because of that. Eh? I mean, and this thing was not there when Haka in the was not there. Tongas, we used to call them Haishas. We used to mock Tongas without any problem. We used to talk about the Tongas. No, Tongas, you know, uh, drinking mazoi without diluting it, finishing a loaf of bread, jumping on a train. We used to make all these jokes before Haka in the came into power. When Haka in the came on the political scene, this became an issue. You can't joke about Tongas. We used to make it, you know, funny of their of their accent, of the Tonga accent. Eh? Haisha, 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 Pong, Tonga, Boo. We used to say all these things. There was, it was not an issue. Now it has become an issue. Now it is hate speech, hate speech, hate speech. Why should it just be hate speech on your side and not hate speech on our side? It's not a nonsense. Come on. Let's face things as they are. Hello? Hello? Good evening, President. Good evening. Are you registered as a voter? Good, good, good. Are you registered as a voter? Mm. It's very important. Uh, I just want to make a comment. Mm. Uh, just on the previous caller, mm. I think uh, this issue of calling each other, it, it hasn't started now. Hello? Even during, even during the period of time, President Lungu used to criticize it. He said, no, he has just concentrated in some certain regions. But the, that was not regarded as a spear. Mm. But this time around, when you just say mm. something, if you need to answer, if you have mm. to no man yet. So, it is strategy to overrate. You say, you have to 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 say, you what is happening? Our one should be saying they want to improve the economy of this country. It's not going to be possible. What these people have done is bad, 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 and those people that they want to follow, mm. most of them, they are in business. Mm. And in business, no power. Why is that one to a man? I'll tell you an example for Malanji. Malanji, he was a businessman far back before the right hand of government. was a business. I want, I want to wait for Malanji's company. Mm. By that time, I was waiting for his company. He had six companies on the property. Now, look at the way Malanda 
followers. I'm not saying Malaysia is going to land. It would have done some, some issues. But look at the recent where those six companies are temporary. How many families are they temporary with? So then they are thinking is it? Oh, we have to come now. We have to come on now. But they are not looking at the families which depend on those people. That's why we poverty home real money. This is where it is coming from. Because most of the businessmen are the PF who are getting themselves in PF. But they are going to And they have shut their businesses. Then they are just looking at those individuals, but they are not looking at the families that, that mm -hmm. they have employed for our one. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And we are going to a very dangerous situation where we are going. Because in like a position, the Thank you, thank you, my brother. And you see, so like this guy, he, thank you, thank you very much, my brother. Yeah, like this guy, uh, this issue of no tribalism and whatever, whatever hate speech. This person has said this thing started a long time. I remember during the time of Mwanawasa, remember there was that issue at Family Forest. Family Forest, Mwanawasa was accused of tribalism. Family Forest, Family Forest, Arabi came, a Sata complained about it. Hey, wako ni wako, hey, wako ni wako, wako ni wako, wako ni wako. So it has been there, and we didn't have it, hey, we, we didn't take it as. We didn't take it as hate speech. Eh? This time around, in hate speech, in this edition, Allah him we. Today can you call them? We pray for. Hello. Hello. Good evening, President. Good evening. Good evening. I just want to make a quick comment on the first caller. Hmm. Ababa, just to manage my emotions. Hmm. At two can each other. Eh, tu waka nechalo, mba nonshi. Ishu ya tribalism, ukulanda po, te problem. Ukui chita, e problem. So if people are talking that no, we have to stop this tribalism thing, it should not be a crime. But the people that are being tribalists, tamre wa konka. Those who are so practicing it. Are, mm. Yes, mm. The, pra the people practicing it. Mm. Konka. When people talk about it, oh, mm. Malaba Konka sedition. Mm. For as long as we don't agree that we have, we don't accept that we have the problem, this tribalism thing will haunt us. We need to talk about it. And Tawafu Rok Tulesho Kulanda. The, the stop will only come that we assume no way, but this is it. It is there, and let's find a way of addressing it. Mm. <laughs> so that man was even emotional and also childish at the same time because I didn't see a reason why he had to go to extents of saying, Don't cross Zambezi, don't watch it. I mean, what was the point of saying all that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> You know, my my dad have How? Am I not an Easterner? Why should I get upset? You know, an Easterner. Eh? I mean, it's very common. Why should I get upset? Eh? Arabi was accused of walking. Why should you get upset? Now this time, when you talk about this, it's a crime. Yeah. It's a crime. It's not a crime because this is a pretty petty thing. But why should we? How and why? And did we come to this? It has become sacred now. You don't touch. It's abomination. It's abomination when you touch it. Eh? <laughs> Thank you, Zambia is bigger than the Ama tribes are. That will require a bash tribalism. Thank you, my sister. Thank you.
हेलो 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 मिस्टर टेरी हाउ आर यू फाइन फाइन थिंग्स हाउ आर यू माय डियर सिस्टर आई एम ओके आर यू रजिस्टर्ड एज अ वोटर आई जस्ट वांट टू आर यू रजिस्टर्ड एज अ वोटर यू वांट टू कंट्रीब्यूट ओके वेरी गुड यस यस मेक श्योर मी आई वांट आई वांट टू टेल माय प्रेस सिंगर्स आई वांट टू टेल माय प्रेस सिंगर्स टू स्टॉप व्हाट दे आर डूइंग इफ दे डोंट लाइक व्हाट यू पोस्ट लेट देम एंड फॉलो यू because for some of us we are suffering mm. but them now they want to start fooling you know i even sent you a video i'm sure you saw it so please let them stop what they are doing as we need the early elections them they are fooling at the 8 up to 2031 <laughs> what is the meaning of that because barungu they used to to insult him mm. in term of him they used to say he's not ruling the nation with prosperity he's failing to control the economy mm. so what's special about you pnz them today they are failing to do the promises that they promised to the people of Zambia but today now they want to start threatening people who want to 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 voice out Zambia is a democratic nation it's not a dictator so for them they should stop in time of Warungu them they used to 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 talk bad things about Warungu did they say them arresting them mm. nothing so now they want to stop us like me precious inonge mbiaita I cannot tolerate this and that's a truth especially where I see that there is injustice mm. me they sent me to prison that I lied that the, the UPND they are not the one who was gassing from there they are failing to arrest gassers then now when we talk they want to start threatening everyone No 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 if they don't like what you post let them and follow you than insulting you Thank we you. don't like that because me I follow you every time Thank you my sister thank you thank, thank you, you very for much. coming to the program mm. yeah. we cannot Hello Hello presenter Yes yes my dear Macho mabwanji Bwino bwino kai mo macho mabwanji kwa nuko Ah tinta be bwino akuru anchi Are you registered as a voter Yo ndiye anza wataya Mm Yeye ndiye anza So manje watali na question cha imozi So monga mwali ni mtonga ngati ni mtonga tingamshite describe bwanji osaka <laughs> watonga katawala zambo haita na masao zena kaiswapa kuingira wedi ya tribe ya kutonga so sio tayari au be calling you a northern watonga will be calling them the southerners wa 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 west wa west and zambo haita na westerners monga ni westerners ma americans ni mwana wangu vinpira ngu vinpira msimu mapanga sense but tayari bwana wangu kaukali kwa zaka ipa bwana ya mtunduri wako eh kuzambia kuna tribe ya ngati 73 tribes ili mzambia tayari wao wana mtamba tu ni msoli sama kalipa Futa mani muira saka lipo. Kama macha ti mtonga ni ukali person sho tonga na kama inangawa nje special tribe. Mm. Yeah, ina mtonga za mtani mtonga tayari. Njoka ni njoka, mwana wa njoka ni njoka, mwana wa njoka sanga nkale galu. Mtonga ni mtonga naye, ni mosa kuna kufusika watu. Sikomo kwa mbili. Sikomo. And you know, get me right, this is not, you know, uh, speaking against the Tongas. I always insist on this program that for me, my best friends are Tongas. Many people that are within my circles are actually southerners. You know, so it's not about Otongas. We are speaking against the practice, the practice, the bad practice of favoring people from the Zambezi region. That's what we are speaking against. Mm. Hello? Hello. That's Lucia. Yes, are you registered? Uh, Before you go on, are you registered as a voter? I'm a registered voter Please. and uh, I I encourage all Zambians to vote mm. because this it's our it's our civil duty right to mm. vote out people that are not performed and that, those that have not fulfilled even a single promise of what they were promising. Mm. So in your conversation please um, 
ask people are you registered yeah. as a voter please go ahead make your contribution but if you, what is wrong with someone being aligned to their to their tribe Imagine. if i am aligned today to say danny i am i am mambwe mm. what is wrong with that mm. like for me you know let's not allow people to divide a nation that was founded on the principle of one zambia one nation just because people are selfish and then they want us to create a, a zambia that is not there play tina you know we should not be scared of anything mm. and then my second point is ever since the uh, the pf leader michael chilfia sata died why would this be why someone should be interested in attending the memorial service to create a confusion that is that does not even is not supposed to be there exactly what He's i mean been a leader for the nation for three years but he has never shown interest to attend the memorial service but why now wait a minute wait a minute that my brother be allowed people. wait a, wait a minute yeah. my brother let me take an opportunity yeah. of uh, this contribution uh to make uh, yes. a comment on that uh, yes. you know the memorial of uh former head of states it is yeah. uh, gazetted that it should be done every five years. Every five years, the government uh, does com commemorate the uh, whoever, uh, former presidents every five years. Five, five years of anniversary. Okay. okay? It's government that takes okay. up the responsibility every five years. So this okay. time around, uh, before five years, Yakumenenishi, by Edgar Lungueva Ripo, and it was celebrated according to the according to the state. Then, okay, this time okay. around, it is now ten years, another five years. So it is a state function. Every five years, uh, okay. the, the the commemoration of um, the former lead or, or a president who has died, it is a state function. These other years, six years, seven years, it is just a family business, okay? But every five years, it is a government function. And as a government function, for example, a church gatherings, according to the British colonial colonialism, you know, we, 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 are, we are following the British, and the British, a, a, a church function, a state church, church function is supposed to be held in a cathedral of the anglican because remember we are coming from the colonials and the the church of england you understand that so that is a history that okay. we have we have inherited so you will find that even a city to be called a city there must be a cathedral and that cathedral is not a catholic cathedral or bread of life cathedral no it is a church of england it is the anglican church eh, th that is the tradition no so wait a minute let me finish no, thank you for making it let, let, me, let, me, yeah. let me finish let me finish that let me finish wait that. a minute let me finish so yeah uh, in all fairness and objectivity what the state is doing this time around it is not making a, a doing politics on satas memorial no it is not it is a state function and as a state function the president whoever the president uh, is supposed to attend unless he for some reason he chooses but otherwise he's supposed to attend so this hula balu which is being created let us be objective this hula balloon which is being created there is nothing political it is just supposed to happen like that so on this one i think he, let us excuse the state and uh, you know allow them to do what they are supposed to do as a state uh, because ningu for ambele but hey ani ali ni katolika nishwa mtu wadi akuna nikane kwa cathedral no it is according to what is prescribed in our you know precepts as a country there is nothing strange about it so you can you can you can conclude so thank you for making it that clarity i think it's important that people are on the same page and i like the way you brought it up mm -hmm. i think that is where we need to be looking at things but it's not just always political like uh -huh. let's not just for be political mm -hmm. but i like what you've said and if what you've said is what it's supposed to be mm -hmm. we're one good yeah we're one good 
No, we we thank you for your program and we I like your point. You're always objective mm. and then when something like this comes up you and you've got answers and you've put me in the right way, mm. I really appreciate that what you say. May God bless you and uh, continue doing what you do for Zambia. Thank you. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. So Thank so you. yeah, so indeed that is a situation that is a situation on Basata. It is a state function and there's a state function the prayers are supposed to be held in the cathedral but this does not mean that this does not mean that the pf cannot the pf or whoever the or the church cannot organize their private whatever they can do it later but let us allow the state to do their function uh, this is it's nothing political it is just what it is uh, thank you hello yes my brother Yes, yes, Mukosa. How are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. How are you? Why na pa why na pa tena ni gym guy. Ah, ni kudia bwino go. Kudia kwa veni madia bwino bwino. This is one thing that imwa ba press singer you don't understand. You think here I'm suffering. No, I just suffer by the fact that I'm here not because I want to. I want to be in my country, but really in terms of life Muntwanga Panja paso panja paninga ninga mm. kuzi panina gadi panja kuzamba simu mani ronda but mm. pa kuno wani ronda na kuni ronda pamene ni ni pano siunga fike pano fika eh kulo kwa vinyi kala bui sure. mm, ah maningi maningi mdala wang mm. um mm. allow me to comment are you registered as a voter bankani atwe are you registered as a voter you are a Zambian I know you will be voting for Aka in the H but that's your right but are you registered as a voter Yes, I am. Okay, very good. Make sure that you encourage other people to register the voter so that Tika Piki Sane Buno Buno next elections. And also Chinga Hakai, also Chinga Eddie Galungu. Like an Eddie Galungu, I immediately, I'm a voter Zian, I voted Raka in the Ichirema. Now, if I'm a voter Zwat, I voted Eddie Gashagalungu. Please go ahead, my brother. Yeah, I want to talk about the nature of tribalism. Hmm. To me, I've always been of the view that uh, in this nation, tribalism is it. We only know tribalism from politics. Yes. I can give an, an example of the people that, most of the people that are, are contributing on this program of yours. Mm. Just check them. I won't mention which, which, which region and tribe they, they are coming from. Just check them. Mm. The people that are supporting I uh, want to add the Galungo to come back. Mm. Just check them. Mm. Just listen when they are contributing. Mm. But what my worry is when a southern or a western or anyone who is not coming from other other regions, uh, which I want to mention because me I'm not a tribal. Support <laughs> no, you should mention it. Uh, uh, you know, why why are you failing to mention it? Why are you failing to mention what's wrong okay, with let me, let, hey. let, 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 let me mention now. Hey, hey. Mm -hmm. When people when people from southern mm -hmm. province support mm -hmm. HH mm -hmm. is it, mm -hmm. it is regarded as tribalism. Okay? When people from eastern province support Edgar Chagwalungu, it's not tribal. Huh? They have a right to support of a, a, a read of their choice. When Edgar Lungu pointed all the, the whole three nine ninety seven percent of the cabinet from two regions. It was not tribalism. But when the HH has appointed the, the cabinet from all the regions, it is called tribalism. So for me, I don't understand the word tribalism, what it means in this country. Is it because some people, they rely on tribalism for them to win the elections? Because in 2021, people did not look at a tribe, they voted on it. On merit, that's why they lost the power. But uh, Mukosa, that's why Mukosa, it, wait, it, it, wait, Mukosa. Wakama party voting. Look at the voting of Southern Province. Can you compare it to the uh, to the to yes. the voting of uh, these other regions? Eh? Look at Southern Province. Look at the way you people, uh, the people of Southern Province, vote. Eh? 
I mean, you vote. But 90%, but 90%, 99%, 99%, eh, for Haka in the election. And through and through, you have been voting like that. And that's why we are complaining because Takwa Boku vote, Takwa so, Imamu vote, Tafe, you want to say, Haka in the election, you want to say, UPND. And you talk about, there is no, allow me to yes, respond. Yes, yes, you respond. Look at Southern Province. There is no any other party there. There is no any other party. Look at Kawangwa. Eh? Look at Kawangwa. You are campaigning freely there. But can, if those elections were held in Southern Province, can the other political parties go and participate? So this is a problem. We are talking about what we are seeing. Anyway, respond. When you talk about the way people vote, mm. what you need to be reminded uh, is that you as a nation we are a democratic country yes we are we don't force people and you don't tell people who to vote listen you talk to and i listen yeah, no, I'm agreeing yes with we you. don't you tell people happy. who to vote you should be happy i'm agreeing with you it's a democratic yes, state we, yes. do, mm. we we don't we don't tell people who to vote for mm -hmm. people vote according to the way they understand their readers mm -hmm. if it, the pf goes to southern province and the only thing they talk about is tribalism and upnd waenda kuja wakamba pale kangalidwe around wa southern province what it ka boyera za kule tirani mankwala ya ngombe za kupangirani madibi do you think they can vote for somebody who always talks about tribalism when he goes there the answer is no. It is about the way you package your message. <laughs> Zambians have got the right to choose or to vote for a read of their choice. No, there is nothing like that that balance the votes. Could it be about and our vote about a five five nine zero five five? No, you vote to according you and the way you have received the message and the hope you have in that reader, so that you know to say well, once I put him, he will look at my problems. No, thank That's you. That's how we brother. vote. Thank we you. are a democratic country. If you, you want to be thank voting, thank you. Tuamvera, Tuamvera, Bamkoza. Hello, 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 my president. Yes, yes, sir. Murishani. We know, we know them quite. Yeah, Murishani, we know. Hmm. Them quite. Ah, we. And therefore, I feel good to respond to the Abachilala and the Bamkoza. Pamela and the Abantu Abachita contribute to the platform. Yes, we are EEP. Mbaga pamonga ifo fwewa memba ba EEP Pweta tuli ba PF <laughs> Nomba ba ta ah uh, Nomba ah, 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 MPZ No this is Awa di ku southern province Awa di ku opposition Awa mene Awa mene councillors Awa di ku southern province Awa opposition mm. Apa ba tayari Amwe register kwa tifano panga Nda pami andi there is no vote for waka inde ichirema Apa next week in day Monday akuru apula to campaign against Aka Inde Ichirema. Nangu ni kufamili kumia andita akuri vote for Aka Inde Ichirema. We are going to vote tribal, not even to run away the truth. Because look where they vote from uh, from southern province. That's what I want to watch. How many MPs from... Uh, how many, how, how many opposition MPs from southern province? Nivanga ba MP haba di kuru apula province haba kwa Aka Inde Ichirema. Nivanga ba MP haba di ku kuno na ni ku eastern province yaba kwa ka inde ichirema ni banga ba mp yaba di ku ku northern province yaba kwa ka inde ichirema why ba ba eastern azaba tonga ba refu okula biika tribal pa bantu haba supported ya ka inde ichirema ba diaba shiri tribal ba refu haba yetufarika tribal so apa ama election ya ama election ya alay sa 2026 pirafi nechi haba tonga ba vota eto tuwala vota na ifwe Thank and this you. is the message we take to our people. Kuma lulo areas, <laughs> apatulebo mfiate kwa cho tulefu ya na mali sources from, we are going to use our resources to tell people to vote against President Aka in the HDM. Because even if you can look at President Tayari, Thank you, boss. Thank you. 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 Hello. Hello? 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 Mr. Tayali. Yes, how are you, my dear sister? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm okay. Are you registered as a voter? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Are you registered as a voter? Very much registered as a voter. 
Thank you, thank you. There is no question about that, Mr. Tayali. We have to be registered voters and make sure we do what is required of us mm. for our civic rights as Zambians. Sure, thank you. Please go ahead, my sister. Now, Mr. Tayali, remember, yeah, was it on Wednesday? Mm. I promise to give you statistics. Yes, 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 yes. I'm still compiling and i think i sent you a message to tell, to inform you that uh, I, I still had a few challenges here and there mm. uh, maybe let me just give a, a short uh, narration of what's going on mm. um you know uh, when you look at the statistics that we are concerned about for instance infl inflation mm. uh, exchange rate mm. and these other things when i look at the various reports that are valuable mm. I'm seeing a lot of people say here and there of what has been reported in this report and what is reported in this report. And uh, like I told you, mm. I want to give you information that is uh, authentic and uh, information that is coming from Zambia Statistics Agency because yes. I believe that is the government institution that should provide uh, 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 official statistics. statistics. Yes. Mm. Yes. However, when I compare what. Uh, Zamfet has and what maybe uh, Ministry of Finance because uh, I was looking at the economic reports for, for mm. those whatever I'm seeing that for Ministry of Finance they are reporting maybe just the average for instance uh, uh, instead of reporting inflation at, at every year mm. for that particular month like mm. December mm. they'll go and do the average for the whole january to december mm. so instead of you seeing a certain uh, figure mm. you realize that okay december inflation was maybe 13.1 mm. and then uh, because they've done the average you find that the, uh, the inflation is 10.2 mm. so you see they're now looking at them as uh, i not say it's statistically that should be the ideal that's number one issue however i'm having challenges when i look at how is the inflation computed mm. inflation is computed on the change of prices here and there and mm. then if i look at the prices in 2021 and the prices of 2023 mm. uh, honestly speaking i shouldn't see that kind of reduction in the inflation rate unless there's a methodology that i'm not understanding of how they are computing the inflation rate because the, 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 the prices in 2021 or 2022 or 2023 we are lower than the prices in 2024 so why should the inflation be lower in 2024 and not 2023 so those are the challenges that i'm having and i'm trying to just uh, verify here and there so that i give you reliable information so that's why i, I wanted you to just get to know and it's not an easy job because i have to check a number of uh, reports here and there before i give you the information mm. no uh, yeah so otherwise i'm, I'm on it Mm. I'll take a bit of time, even the Sunday that I promise I'll give you, it might not be easy because I just want to give you something that we can work with and authenticate and so forth. Absolutely, and I, I appreciate that because I want to tell you that this program um, is actually followed even by uh, people from outside Zambia. So the information that I put, you know, I tend to be very careful and it is good that you're yes. taking your time such that when we put it out there even the people outside who look at uh, i mean some of the things that i post on the page will be able to appreciate uh, uh, what you bring out so thank yes you very much, yes because like i like, like i in indicated i said i've followed you and i know who you are you don't do propaganda you don't know you are very objective and mm. i like that so on that basis i don't want to give you Mingalato statistics. No, yeah. I want to give you statistics which are very objective and representative of a national picture. Thank you, my sister. Thank you very much. Mm. Thank you so much, Mr. Tayali. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Uh, yes, my dear. I'm present. We know we from our home. We know we know. I thought that I was going to be home. Mm. Are you, are you registered as a voter? Very much. I have a shivandi, Havana. I'm a dependent. I'm a reform. Very good. Very good.
make sure yes. that na wonse bali aba pachipanda na bali wonse bo mwikala na bo wonse no bo bomba na bo wonse make sure they register as voters it doesn't matter who they vote for but let them register as voters sawa ma tocha un fa program en ma pa mm kaine o ma bandi ba be mba gefe ga tsanda o ka ba ba tong so gefe ga tsanda ba mukoso ko ba ti when it's come to politics ero ile sana en kan tribalism no ma be na wana ku ba danda ora pano ko ba ti u sheni sho mutundu we suno ba wa patukira ku di shimi tundu shimbi o mundu jo ara nda ba tonga mu katen wana ba tonga mu katen Ah we that for the time for na chwana ta no mbare cha chupa ni chwana fo afoko ra myanga ku makasa nomba there is no way bana fo afoko ku ra myanga na ku makasa there is no way these days no ingira fo mo office idi on singo ra nda chitundu chimbita wa mune ko munthu okumune ko munthu ka mwambo ku onje cha chine chitundu which is not good bale chita tichungu let's unite our country bale chita tichungu at let's tichungu Eh, at landeni tsungu. At landeni tsungu. Imagine eh. Awe, 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 awe. Let's differ, but if you what na kwaka kwaka tsanda tyo twaka ne tsaro bupu ba muti. Kire imwene sha mufi. Eh? Kire iranga za tsya ba tribe. There is no way. Na mwana na from tundu mbite tribe. Na mwana na pa dibe na e tribe. Ni message nshi ya kwata ba kain de chi de mea kwa bati. Bena ba ba kwata ma impizu kukumbi. Ukukumbi wena wako watafi message ya tribe, come on. We are not fooling our wena mkosa. No, thank you. Okay, mwombe wena wa president. I am seeing, I've seen a comment, before I pick another call, I've seen a comment, even in Banda, even in Banda you are asking to say, I want to transfer. Where can I, where should I go? Go to where they are registering, where they are registering, go there, they will advise you. Go to where you want to register and tell them to say, I want to transfer. Go where you want to transfer. Go and tell them, I am a voter this side and I want to transfer. Uh, do it as soon as possible because that's where there are a lot of problems. So you go where they are registering and they will advise you. They will advise you. Please go and, uh, you know, approach ECZ. Eh? register as 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 voters are you registered as a voter hello good evening president good evening yes sir are you registered oh, as a voter i just are you registered yes, as boss, a voter definitely. please please make sure that yes, other boss. people are also registered as voters please go ahead mm. Thank you very much. I just wanted to respond to Mr. Mukosa. Mm. Mr. Mukosa, last time I asked him a question, he didn't even reply. Is he normal or what? <laughs> he's very normal. Sorry to mention this. He's very normal. No, he's not normal. He needs <laughs> need to be taken to mental med checkups. Umfuen Bossi. Umfuen Bossi. You know, yes, let, me, let me defend uh -huh. him. Uh, let's not attack he, him so much personally because really, oh, I, I mean, he has got different views, but those different views doesn't mean that he's not normal. <laughs> that is how he sees things. So no. Let's respect no. that. He doesn't, he doesn't understand point. what we are passing through. Yeah, he so doesn't understand talk what, about we that. Talk about what we are going mm. through. Mm. Huh? Yeah. Then he comes out and is speaking like that, meaning he. Yeah, I don't know what I can say. I don't know. No wonder why. Yeah, boss. You know. <laughs> Mukosa, Mukosa, please behave yourself. Thank you. <laughs> behave yourself, Mr. Mukosa, please. <laughs> <Yeah>. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Don't be. HH will not be there forever. One day you come out from that seat. Mm. Anyway, enough is enough. Good night, Mr. President. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, let's avoid, the, you know, going, being too personal and attacking the personality. We can talk about issues. Hello? Hello. Hello. Good evening, Mr. Ta. Good evening. Yeah. A very good uh, program. Uh, keep it up. Thank you. Are you registered uh, as a I voter? 
very much very i've good. been voting i think the last time uh, the last time i didn't cast a vote uh i think it was 2011 when i was just outside the country at some point yeah this time you must reject you must vote mm. yeah uh, definitely even last time i did mm, thank you it's it's <laughs> agreeing for you <laughs> thank you <laughs> please go ahead. Yeah, the issues of the issues of tribalism mm. Um, these people are just tribal. There's no, there's no beating by the bush, they're just tribal. And people have become big headed in these offices because they are the ones managing their, their affairs of the country. And uh, I'm, I'm very surprised when the other uh, party was in power and the other regimes, there was no such issues of tribalism. But when they were ushered into office, ish, ah. <laughs> now they're, they're on the top of the world. Mm. They're bragging too much. Mm. At it's their too time. Much arro- there's too much arrogance. Mm. No, it's, 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 it, it could be their time, but the other, the other regions were not uh, showing that arrogance to say he, a president is coming from our region. Mm. We're just level headed and like these people. The big headed. <laughs> That's why it's irritating, huh? <laughs> That's very irritating. You can't wait for them to go. Serious, I hate them. <laughs> thank you, my With brother. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Hello. 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 Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Uh, yes. Um, I'll start with the issues on uh, tribalism. Before you, before you go on, are you registered as a voter? Yes, I am. Very and I'm uh, asking others to also register. Please, please, let us register as voters. Please go ahead, my brother. Yes. So, uh, tribalism at the moment has been uh, <coughs> institutionalized now. Mm. Yeah. It has become an institution mm-hmm. like where when you check the parastatos, mm. it's just one region. When you check the ministries, like it's concentrated on uh, one region. Check the service chiefs, it's one region. Mm. Check the courts, the judiciary, it's one mm. region. Mm. Mm. So uh, when uh, UPND votes uh, are coming from southern province, you find the entire southern province votes for UPND. Mm. So then when you look at the foundation of UPN, the UPN was founded on regionalism, ethnicity, and tribalism, even their own foundation. Even mm. the current uh, person who is in charge of UPN, they had said that it's only a Tonga who could uh, lead UPN at that particular time. Mm. So if that is not tribalism, then what is tribalism? Yeah. Hello. Yeah, hello. Yes, yes, we can hear. Yes, if if that is not tribalism, then what is tribalism? Because mm. uh, it's like uh, their party is uh, built on tribalism. So, but then, like the thing that Zambians must know is that uh, first of all, Zambians never voted for UPND because UPND was a strong party. No, mm. Zambians voted for UPND because at that particular time they wanted change. So therefore, UPND doesn't have structures. Their structures are not even strong. So it is an easiest part to remove from power. Yeah. So they should be packing. They should be packing their bags now. Whatever they are going to try to use, it won't work out because I think Zambians are saying that uh, they want change because it is the first time when Zambians are going for three days without electricity. Mm. without water mm. then the cost of food are extremely high mm. the cost of fuel is extremely high as well so it's a, almost a first time in 60 years of independence mm. therefore UPND must be packing and I think in any case they've divided the nation they've taken us back maybe 60 years again mm. uh, uh, our forefathers Kenneth Kaunda and them guys had, had the wisdom of uh, bringing the country together but what we have now is uh, a, a place where now the country is being divided 
They've even gone ahead. They're also dividing the region. So those are the few points that I wanted to make. Good evening and thanks for your platform. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hello? 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 Yes, please. Hello? Yes, yes, President Talai. Yes, yes. How are you, my dear? Fine, fine. How are you? Are you registered as a voter? Of course. Why not? Very good, very good. Um, it's a good program. You are getting a lot of masses in Zambia. Mm. Yeah, so the point I'm trying to put across is that uh, UPND government has really failed us. Mm. The cost of living is very high. Uh, the, the cost of doing business is also, mm. is also high. Yeah, the cost of doing Issues of, yeah, Mingaland. Mm. Mm. Governance, democracy, it's a crisis. Mm. So, in short, uh, UPND has failed. Mm -hmm. I'm one of the followers and I even voted for them, but uh, not anymore. <laughs> Make sure you go and vote. <laughs> Hello? Yes, Uncle Tari, Mwa President Tari, Mwa Mwa Bomba Shani Mkwai. Mwina Mwina Fem Kwai, Mwini Shan Naim. Mwina Tuariwa, Orede, Tuariwa, Ava Ipekanya Kuku Vota Bose, Ama Voting, Ama Voters Card, Natu Ipekanya Fion Sokwa. Mwa Adile Mbesha Fion Sokwa Vota? Fion Sokwa, Tuwa Adile Mbesha Fion Sokwa, Mr. President. Mwumekin Yeshua, Na Bonsa, Ava Nava Le Kula Bonsa, Bate Shani, Bakwa Ata Mareji, Bate Tena Na Registo Kukwa. Exactly. Mkwai. Mkwai. Na Valande Mkwai. So, Ukula Ndako, Pali tribalism. Ushe, ave ne ava ama brothers versus ama sister na ava fiash versus ava fuma kusauzeng. Ushe, ve na ava ne chimona shani na chako wa tifia ire kuli civil war because of their tribalism. Because the situation is quite far from Tuarela. It's not good. Na ava vika fia pamulu kwati. Yeah, I've lost that caller. No. Oh, sorry. Hello? 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 Yes, good evening, Mr. Tayari. Good evening. Are you registered as a voter? Definitely, not to worry about it. I'm, um, I'm a well registered Zambian. Thank you. Uh, I don't know what has happened there. Uh, hello? Uh, hello? Hello? Yes, hello. Mule landi ya mule my kind. Mule landa straight in phone. Kwa ti mule ya. Hello? Yes, Mr. Tayari. Yes, we can hear you now. Please go ahead. Yes, I'm, I'm actually registered i have registered and my family have registered also we voted in 2021 election mm. uh, my, my my question and my concern is about the issues we are talking about this evening I believe. Mm. like if you check on the current happenings or the current arresting of people politicians good politicians it is only happening in the two regions which is the east and the and the northern mm. but again my, my question which, which, which i have which i always ask is uh, all these people politicians that are coming from southern province western province not western province where we are coming from because when we look at the GBM, the case of GBM, that the case happened in 2020, 20, if I'm not mistaken. Hey. 
Hello? Hello? Yes, please. Yeah, the, the, the case of GBM. Mm. It happened in 2013, and if I remember very well, that is the case which which happened during when Sata was the president. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. he was with you in Honorable Winter Kavimba, and the, the, the case was adjudicated upon, it was passed, but today, GBM is, he has faced the same, the, the same problem. Why not face most of these other people like them, Winter Kavimba, where are they? Because, let me tell you, my brother, actually on this one, by each three accused, the same way GBM was accused, that's the same way Winter Kabimba was also accused. Winter Kabimba was also accused of having had involved in the uh, fuel issue, issuing a contract to Trafigura. Trafigura. Eh? So, it had in 50 50. GBM was pointing at Winter Kabimba. Winter Kabimba was pointing at GBM. But now, did that work yet? Yeah, about winter, but anyway, she, I'm not she could have a winter, but I'm just agreeing with you. Mm. Okay, so uh, we, we talk of uh, JJ Banda, we, we talk of uh, people that are being you know facing uh, facing a lot of challenges, people that are facing a lot of cases in this country. I think you are just members and listeners. What about these people? These other people. Where we are coming from, and when you look at the voting pattern, and does it mean that uh, all the political parties in Zambia they don't have the proper message to give to the people of the province? <laughs> is, is, is actually what is Mr. Mukosa telling the Zambian people that all the politicians in Zambia they don't have the message to tell that they want Benga Shalwala? I think we'll be providing the vaccines that I'm going to will be providing with so so that, that we, the politicians fail to tell these people from this other side. And my brother, let me tell you, you have that point that you have made. You know, do you realize that Edgar Lungu or PF per se actually did a lot of development in Southern Province? They did a lot of, you go to Southern Province, yes, look yes. at the road. Eh? Look at even within southern province, they did so much. Even this road, which they are finishing now, eh, the one between between um, eh, Lusaka and Kafue, it was started by Ed Galungu. Ed Galungu did uh, a lot of projects in southern province. Eh? But look at the votes when the Ed Galungu was, eh, when the votes were coming out. So it is not true with what Mukosha is talking about, really. Yeah, yeah, because when you look at the uh, Kafiwe, I think he, uh, uh, down down 2021, I was in, I was in Kafiwe up to Mazambuka. The road was very pathetic, very impossible, but uh, Eddie Galun did a favor. He managed to clean up the road. The road is not now almost 100%, in fact, 100% from Mazambuka to Kafiwe to Mazambuka. He opened up to Ndumwezi where there were no power, but mm. today there is yes. power there. Yes. Hmm. All those things that they, they, they can't appreciate. Look at the Kazungula, the Kazungula Bridge, the famous Kazungula Bridge in Zambia. Where, where is it? Thank you. Look at Luapula. Which one is the massive? Yes, yes. 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 Eh? No, Southern Province. Which one is the massive uh, project in, in, in Luapula? Mm. No, thank you, my brother. Thank you. There is no massive. Mm. Thank you. I, I, I see Mukosa is calling again, but Mukosa, on this program, we only allow one call at a time. Uh, it's not a debate. It's not a debate. So I cannot, uh, you know, you, you come in, you come in. Uh, there are a lot of people that want to contribute. Hello? Hello, Mr. Tari. Good evening. Good evening, my brother. Are you registered as a voter? I am registered as a voter, uh, Mr. Tari. Good. So tonight, eh, I just called that, um, as a contender person over what is happening. Mm -hmm. You know, last time we spoke about uh, our uh, these big politicians, especially those who are you know political affiliated. Mm. You know, they expect us, you know, bloggers. They expect us, you know, 
uh, small politicians to speak for them. And when we're in trouble, we do You see? Are we, you, my brother, no, I can, we, uh, we are almost losing you. Uh, can you speak direct in the phone? I don't know if you're using a, a headset or you have put it on loud so that we can hear you properly. Am I audible enough now? Better now, yes. Please go ahead. Okay, so I was, uh, I was talking about, you know, how these people, we speak for. Don't go, Babina, Sparks, you know, these MPs, and uh, these other business people. You know, the last time we spoke about this, to say, we need to support us, especially we, the people that are putting our phone there, we have. Mm. Let them support us as well. The same mm. support that we not give them, they're in trouble. We expect the same support uh, from them when we're in trouble. Mm. But it seems like, you know, uh, it's not the Talk of Arena Sparks. They were supposed to be funding people like you, funding people like us, and that mm. You know, those political affiliate. So we need to complain to say, I've been a very That's what it's like, some of the issues. That's what the issues. You see? And no, they, are, they can't show me that to complain. But we can speak on their behalf. But when we speak on their behalf, we think that okay for them now. They don't come back as supporters. You see? Last time, last time, you, Mr. Tali, you are even setting your highlights. How many people come on, on, on your on your age? Mm. Play that highlight. Mm. You're in trouble. Mm. But how many people do support you? Mm. Eh? You're in trouble. How many people do you speak for? Mm. And among the people that you speak for, how many people come back and support you? You see? So if they don't speak for you, and Mr. Tali, for me, a company, this is why I'm going to be like, I'm going to be like, I'm going to be like, because look at that church chamber. That people was arrested. He's a one of the biggest guy. You see, but he comes on screen begging for a book. What is the people that he speaks for? Mm. You see? So we we'll come here, we we'll talk, we we'll talk, we we'll talk with a solution because the people that are speaking for their coffee speak. They are selfish and they are repeating this to speak. The people that are speaking for their selfish. Mm. And this is the reason why nothing changing. But nothing changing. Mm. Because someone is a big thing. Mm. Someone tell it, there's no support. Mm. Uh, there's no support. Mm. Uh, there's no support. There is politics. There's support to begin to support. Even if it's not financially. But people speak for the same way we speak for them. Mm. Uh, but I don't feel like I need. Uh, Mandy, but many welcome by you. You know, um, uh, what you have just spoken about, eh? you have you have just reminded me. Uh, and let me... Let me let me let me talk about this. What this I mean I, I want to assume is a young man. What this this gentleman has spoken about is is very true. You know, Zambian uh, Zambian uh, business environment is very political. I want you I want to make this this point. Zambian business environment is very political. And if you are a business person, you can't run away from the politics. You can't. You can't run away from the politics. And somewhere, somehow, you need to have a little bit of influence in politics. If you don't have the influence in politics, no matter how strong your business is, one day you will just crumble. Your business will just go down. It doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter how strong you are. Look at, for example, uh, Mpoha. Look at Mpoha. Eh? Savenda. I mean, Bamdalavana is very powerful, very strong. But look what is happening. Look at GBM. GBM was a very powerful businessman. Look at what is happening. Zambian politics is highly, uh, Zambian business is highly political. And some of you people, so those of you who are in business who ignore who ignore us who ignore us who are in politics who ignore us who do your advocacy you are you are putting yourself uh, at risk because you need us at one point you need us at one point 
you will need us at one point for you to succeed in that business of yours you need people to speak for you but unfortunately unfortunately some of you who are in business you don't want to support us and this is what this young man is talking about and i agree with him a lot of you people that's when you come to me that's when you come but when things are okay with you you don't even uh, dare talk to me you don't even dare talk to me uh, this man is talking about sparks for me sparks is just i don't know he is one of the selfish businessmen he's one of the selfish business me i've stood for sparks a number of times but the guy i mean is just there i mean i find him to be selfish and arrogant and i just don't care about him i mean just that of course my advocacy is advocacy it's not about you you pay me so even if he, you don't help me even if you are arrogant even if you are selfish when there is something that is happening which is of justice i will speak i will speak for you sparks for me i find him as one of arrogant and selfish guy and he can go to hell but when an injustice is done to him i will still speak for him there are other people even this lawyer guy eh? Lua guy, whatever, whatever, whatever. And we were talking. But when he is doing fine, I mean, those boys, you don't hear of them. It's okay. You can remain with your money. You can continue doing your businesses. But for us, for me, at least for me, it doesn't matter whether you have helped me, whether you have not helped me. If there is something that is happening is of an injustice, I will speak for you and mostly I speak because some of you you have employed a lot of people like Sparks. Sparks has a number of people that are working under him. So as arrogant as he may be, as selfish as he may be, you know, but I will speak for him because he has a number of people under him. But really from my point of view, because some of you even like to think to say when we speak about it, we speak for some of these people, you think that they have paid us they don't and for me i speak not because you have given me i will speak for you because i believe that what is being done to you is an injustice like what is happening right now uh could he sparks uh my i mean the guy has a license and the people amakadas they're just going into his uh property and doing whatever it is i mean you you cannot just be taking cadres. You want to impress cadres, and you take them into somebody's property. That is not right. So I believe on Sparks that what is happening to Sparks at the moment, what is going on there, it is not right. It is not right. It is not right. And I will speak against such injustices, not because Sparks has given me anything. Me, I've been advocating for Sparks for 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 a number of times, even when they incarcerated him every time that i had an opportunity i used to speak for sparks but uh, you know they accused the sparks of you know being involved in gassing and whatever whatever i was every day coming on social media defending sparks because sparks was not involved in gassing but did he give me did he give me anything i am telling you here i never got not even one penny from sparks not even one penny from sparks i never got anything I am not saying you should give me anything. Basically, what I'm just saying is that I'm re-echoing what this young man said. That you people who are in business, support some of these advocates. It's not just me. Even these young people, support them. These people who talk, support them. Some of these uh, political whatever activists, support them in a way. In a way, support them. Eh? Not uh, if you are much but uh, anyway from my point of view what i do i believe god is the one that looks after me god is the one that looks after me no one individual can say N -n -n uh -uh. and that's why i always pledge myself to speak against injustices it doesn't matter who is involved even a person that i don't uh, not that i don't like even in the when he faced an injustice i spoke for him that is me I never got anything from Haka in the but whenever I saw that Haka in the was being treated unjustly, I did speak for him. Of course, I also accused him of his wrong things. That is how I operate anyway.
let's continue with the phone calls. But I just had, I took an opportunity. Hey, phone Yashima. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Phone Yashima. Uh, I think, uh, I mean, for me to connect it and charge it, it will be a bit of a problem. Um, the phone has, um, has, has, has gone off. Otherwise, let me just even end here. Um, thank you very much for following the program. But uh, for, for tonight, my main issue, my main issue is us preparing for the next election. We have, we have to prepare for the next election. And how do we prepare? The first thing from the citizens is that we have to register as voters. It doesn't matter whether you are supporting UPND, whether you are supporting a PF, you are supporting whichever party, I don't care. What I'm just saying is that we need to register as voters. And from there, I still want to re-echo this, that all those who are involved in the eligibility case, sana sana mwema judges, already yes, there is bias. We have seen that there is bias already, but you can still Ex you can still exonerate yourselves. You can still exonerate yourselves. This case of Ed Galungu is not a new case to Apapata. It is not a new case. Ed Galungu was on the ballot in 2021. There is no way you are going to overturn things. I mean, it is just not right. It is just not right. So allow Ed Galungu to be on the ballot and let the people, let the Zambian people decide whether they will vote for him or they will not vote for him. Let the Zambian people exercise their right to reject Ed Galungu for the second time, if they so wish. But it shouldn't be you, you know, to abjure, to, abjure, to abjure the, you know, the wishes of the people. Let the people, let the people be the one to decide, to apapata. That is my, my, my appeal. To the Zambian people, I'm saying, go out and vote. To the judges, I'm appealing to you, please, can you do the right thing? Can you do the right thing? Let Ed Galungu be on the ballot. This is political. There is nothing here about no law, whatever, whatever. It is political. But don't curtail Ed Galungu from contesting the next election. Let him be there. Tuapapata. Tuapapata. And, um, you know, with that, I say, please, let us go out there and make sure that every other person has registered to vote. May God bless you and may God bless Zambia. Good night. All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.